Seeing double. Here at Pint Sized, we like to be a little bit ahead of the game. So today on the show, we've got Cloudwater's DIPA version 11. The latest of... What? They're already done version 12 and it's being canned. Oh, for fuck's sake. Cloudwater love to tease us beer lovers with their almost monthly releases of their search for the ultimate double IPA. We loved their version 4 and version 5, which we reviewed simultaneously, if you remember, and I couldn't wait to get version 11 on the show, and by the time we did, well, they've already done version 12, and it's in a can, and it looks great. Great! Anyway, version 11 certainly isn't old news. It's got over double the amount of oats in the Grister's version 10, with Vic Secret, a leading light in the world of Australian hops, leading the hop charge, with Mosaic and EXP431 as the backing singers. We don't need to talk about this one anymore, let's let the beer do the talking, get version 11 in a glass so I can go out and get version 12. So here we are, Cloudwater Brewery out of Manchester's double IPA version 11, 9% special edition. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Interestingly, the only one of these double IPA ranges on rate beer with a score of 100 out of 100 is their version 4. Although it's not that hard, seeing as all the other double IPAs by Cloudwater have a score of 99. So they're by no means bad. So here we go, the version 11 of Cloudwater Brewery's search for the ultimate double IPA. That is hazy. That is stunning, I can smell the smells. That is juicy, that is a lovely golden colour, really nice head on there. Oh, that's just lovely, it looks, it looks deep, it looks fruity, it just, I wanna kiss it. Oh, big peach. Oh, strawberry berries. Mmm, peach, that's peach fruit hop. Mmm, peach o -ramos. Oh yeah, oh, what is that? Haribo peaches, that's what that is. Cheers. Mm. Whoa! <laughs> oh, there's a fly on my face. I'm, I'm, I'm a plague. Mm. Oh, I'm switching hands. Mm. 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 A lot less sweet than I expected it to be from that intensely sweet peachy smell. It's got a nice multi backbone to stop it from going full Tropicana. But yeah, it's. Oh, that's bitter. Oh, talking through it now, it's almost sticky. There was, a, there was a real oily, smooth mouth feel. So that bitterness really is quite overwhelming. It's really not how I expected. <coughs> oh, uh, as, as double IPAs go, as IPAs go, I mean, it's, it's stunning. So yeah, with, with breweries like Cloudwater, it's a pretty great time to be a beer lover, to be honest. That's all from me. I'm off to go and watch the new Star Wars film, A New Hope, I think it's called. Then come home, have a little bit of a play on my etcher sketch and then sit down for an evening on my Philips CDI. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you all next time.